He isn't called Mr. Dakar for nothing. In 26 appearances on the rally, Stefan Petterhansel has won a staggering 12 titles, six on a Yamaha, six in cars. It all started on African soil back in 1988. It's a rather traumatic memory. One of my Yamaha teammates, Belgian André Malherbe, crashed and ended up paralysed. It's something that had a big impact on me and has shaped my whole career on the Dakar. Meaning that the Dakar isn't just a game, it's a really dangerous race. And if you want to finish it and why not win it, you're going to have to ride carefully and keep a good safety margin. It has steered all my career since then. I had dreamt of doing the Dakar. I then dreamt of winning it. And for the first time, I won it in 1991. Yamaha also won after years of setbacks. It remains the best ever memory for me on the Dakar. This could be the beginning of a new career for me. When I did that first Dakar, I said to myself, it's a lot easier being in a car. The co-driver takes care of all the navigation. It isn't as dangerous. We have protection all around us. The first thing that came to mind when I finished that Dakar is the Dakar in a car is a holiday. For the first time, I shared victory with someone else, with Jean-Paul Cotre, and I also showed that I could do well in a car. To win on a bike was great, to win in a car was great, but to win with a French manufacturer, a factory team who were on the Dakar 25 years ago when I started on a bike, the TV shots of Vatnan in the desert still resonate in my memory. So we rewrote history with Peugeot and that victory last year is also one of the best of my career.